I'm going to start this video with a little bit of an apology. I did not realize when I popped those last few videos up that it was going to go Well, whenever you guys see something like that, leave me a comment. Let me know what's going on because if I don't know, then I can't fix it. So, um... I'm sorry about that, and hopefully that'll never happen again. I'll make sure to check every video before I pop them up. Alright. Having said all of that, let's go on with this. Alright, I'm going to talk about in this video the trichotomy axiom. What does the trichotomy axiom actually mean? Well, it means to divide into parts. Alright, now, um, when we're talking specifically about the trichotomy axiom, we're talking about having a certain condition which is true. In this case, either x will equal y, x will be greater than y, or x will be less than y. But it will only be one of these three conditions. It won't be all three. Okay, so that's basically the trichotomy axiom in a nutshell. Either it will be um, one, two, or three. So, that pretty much breaks it down into a nutshell. I will cover more in a future video, so stay tuned. 